Hi, I'm Josh Boardman, customer service rep with Superior Industries. Today we'd like to talk about squaring our idlers and pulleys to our conveyor frame. The first step we need to take is finding the center of our conveyor frame. We want to use one of our straight cross members, measuring all the way across the truss and putting a mark halfway in between. Measure an arbitrary distance to the edge of the conveyor frame and put a mark. Repeat this same process on the other side of the frame. On the tail section of the conveyor, we will again measure the truss and make a center line mark. As we did in the beginning, we will create lines coming from the center of our truss to the edge of the frame. Clamp a straight edge across the conveyor frame between your two sets of marks. You have now found a square point on your conveyor frame. Square the tail pulley by measuring an equal distance from the straight edge to the center point of each side of the pulley. Use the take-ups to square the tail pulley. Remember, the take-ups need to be at an equal amount on each side. Square idlers and rollers by loosening bolts, moving them accordingly an equal distance from the straight edge to the center point of each component item, then retighten. You may now begin to load your belt with material and test under normal operating conditions. However, there may be further belt tracking required. 